Speaking of college football, uh, we're bringing you the ultimate tailgating party this morning. Starting at 8 a.m. Eastern, we're heading outside to Atlanta's Centennial Olympic Park to show you how to tailgate in style. It's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah. And, and we're also going to be putting some football fans to the test with the tailgating cook-off. And they're going to be judged by three top chefs. But you, you have to, you realize you have to bring back leftovers. Right? Oh, yeah. They're sending okay. me out there to taste this food. And you're going to bring back leftovers is my point. You better. I said you look nice today. <laughs> okay, that's not enough. We want food. <laughs> Wow. So you guys are probably, you got to be a little jealous of, of my morning right now. College football isn't just all about uh, going to the game, sitting down, having a talk, a hot dog with one of your, your, your fellow friends. It's all about the pregame. It's all about getting yourself ready, tailgating. Some people do tailgating on the cheap and some people do tailgating in a very expensive way. Right now, I'm at the, the, the dream tailgate, the ultimate fan dream tailgate. You got 60 inch TVs, you got tons of food, you've got a fridge full of beer, and then you come all the way down here, you got another 60 inch TV, and also a little, uh, little uh, uh, keg. Some, some people have, like at Nebraska, we dye our beer red, which is pretty, pretty cool. Today, we're gonna, be, uh, we're gonna be having so much food. We have four fans coming in, and they're going to make us their best tailgating food. And what the cool part is, we have three celebrity chef judges that are gonna be judging their food and gonna let them know if, if their food has what it takes to be at a tailgate or not. We're gonna be doing that soon. And the judges, the celebrity chef judges, are gonna give us um, um, some, some uh, tailgating tips on how to do it on the cheap, a really good tailgate. Lynn? All right, Brian, just one thing about your live shot that we need you to get taken care of. Uh, turn that TV to Morning yeah. Express. What are you doing, buddy? Come on! It's football season. <laughs> what can I do? We have the big one on Morning Express. You can right. take a look, take a gander at that right there. There you go. All right, doing your due diligence. Bring, hey, I'm gonna bring some food back for you, Lynn. You better. I'm holding you to it. We'll see you in a bit. And don't forget about the Tom's Tailgate Ultimate Sweepstakes. Your chance to win a grilling kit. Here's what you need to do: send us a photo of your favorite recipe. Maybe you have an outfit or even a tricked-out grill that impresses all your friends. Just post it on Instagram, Facebook, or Twitter. Use the hashtag Tums Tailgate Sweeps. And then your fellow viewers will vote each week, and their favorite wins the tailgate kit. The last day to enter for the fan favorite prize is going to be January 4th, 2015. And then we'll announce a winner live on air by February 1st. And we will spend, send you a special prize in the mail. We're talking tailgating. It's that time of year again, so we sent Brian McFadden hey. for the heavy lifting. Hey, Bri. Yeah, I'm doing some heavy lifting. Welcome to the 2014 Tom's Tailgate uh, Cook-Off. And I'm hanging out with some college football fans. They prepared some food. We've got celebrity chef judges that, that prepared to judge, and I'm about to prepare myself to eat. Be jealous. So I'm at the Tums Ultimate Tailgate Cook-Off. We're about to have uh, a cook-off, a good old-fashioned cook-off. Check this out. Look at the food and our football fans right here. This is Peggy Grimes. And Peggy, you made uh, yourself a uh, jalapeno cream cheese stuffed sausage wrapped in bacon. That sounds like it's going to hurt. That's why you have Tums. <laughs> Hopefully not. Hopefully it's just got a little flavor, a little spice, a little zing. It'll be right what you're looking for. Is this your recipe? It's kind of a hybrid of a couple recipes. Okay, I, I want to, I maybe I can get it um, during a commercial break. Of course. <laughs> I like her already. All right, so Mark Hall, the barbecue brisket blue cheese sandwich. This smells like you just made it just now. Yeah, yeah I did actually. Uh, it cooked all night, and uh, you actually left off the bacon. So oh, the, everything's better with bacon. It, I, I happen to, to agree with you. And wearing the Duke shirt, we have, uh, we, we've got uh, Brian Fortune and Mike Haffery. And oh, in the, uh, in the Clemson shirt, you guys made the barbecue pork sliders. That's it. That's gonna be like really tasty. Are you guys ready for for to, to be judged by our celebrity chefs? Yeah, we're ready. Yeah, we're ready. Yeah, we're ready. When we come back, it's gonna be the ultimate cook-off. Celebrity chefs are gonna be tasting these. I'm gonna actually taste some too. Lynn, I promise you, I'm gonna bring this back for you. I, I am promise you. Hold I'll save you, you just to a little it. bit. All right, sounds good, Brian. Have fun out there. We'll check in with you in the next hour. It is kickoff to football season. College football is what we're talking today. That means the grills are gonna be fired up for all those fun tailgates. And Brian McFadden took on the tough job this morning to show you some do's and don'ts of tailgating. We had to twist your arm for yep. this one, Brian. Yeah, you did. I'm, you know, to many a man, woman, and child, college football is all about the food, and we're about to have our Tums Tailgate Cook-Off 
cook-off. Um, it's, it's about to happen. We've got celebrity chef judges here. I'm going to be eating some food. I'm going to bring it back to you and Bob in the studio. So you guys can eat some of it. I may not have much left when I'm done with it, but you guys might have something. Yeah, but not you, a problem. Tune in for this. It's going to be really good. Bob's already got his stretchy pants already right. ready. He yeah, is right. He's warmed up. <laughs> My he's belt is some, off. Exactly. Didn't eat breakfast. The fat pants. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The fat pants. All right, guys. We'll see you in a bit. You know what that sound means. Let the tailgating begin. College football season officially kicks off this weekend. Grills coast to coast are going to be heating up. So Brian good sound. is out there. I love that sound. You're out there for your very own cook-off. It's a great sound. This is amazing. We're moments away from Tom's ultimate uh, tailgate cook-off. And I, I'm, I'm amongst friends. This is, we're, we're all, we're like, we're having a little bit of a bromance right here. I'm with celebrity chefs, uh, Kevin Raffin, uh, G. Garvin, and on the spatula, Shane McIntosh. Big Shane! Hey. So we were just talking about tailgates and how, how, um, how awesome it is right before you go to a football game is to get yourself ready and you go to tailgate. Some people don't even go into the game. They sit out and pig out, especially when you guys are yeah. cooking. What makes a great tailgate? Well, the rig behind us makes a great <laughs> That's what it is. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Because you don't even have to go to the game, bro, no. because that thing's on. 70-inch yeah. TV I'm in the middle and 260s on the Absolutely. side. Half the work done already. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> what kind of food do you guys look forward to when you, when you go to a tailgate? Okay. You know what? I think uh, it's all about going out and uh, making sure you're prepped. Like, do some prep at home. Get out, get you some good meat, right. some good cuts, things that are going to cook quickly, lots of flavor, and some really great sauces. Because essentially everybody that's coming to your tailgate, they're they're like coming into your home, and you don't want to disappoint. Yeah. yeah it, like, it, I don't go to that tailgate. That and sucks. any good tailgater has been talking smack all week right. before the big game. Right. So right. you got to be prepared when they come, you know. Think it out a few days ahead, like G said. You know, uh, use the freezer. You know, use big cuts of meat. You know, yeah. put that stuff on. Because, up. well, tons of people go to your tailgates, right? Yeah. And you want to do it on the cheap, because you don't want to be, like, spending a couple <laughs> a couple thousand dollars on people you don't even know. <laughs> really quickly. Yeah, yeah and what, what do you recommend to uh, people at home that, that want to have a tailgate, uh, but they want to do it on the cheap? You know what cheap? I do is I do just a bunch of chicken salad and some bread, and then bring a whole lot of bourbon, okay? Because <laughs> oh, I, bourbon. I, I, I'm, I'm, a firm, I'm, for, I'm a firm believer that you don't want to be cooking when you're, like, Hey, you know, Kevin, <laughs> you got some good stogies, exactly. some good bourbon. And, right. and alcohol kind of uh, kills absolutely. the taste buds a little bit. It, absolutely. It does. You know, it goes hand in hand. With Make it at home, anything. put it in a cooler, bring it. That's, Wonderful that's tips from, from our celebrity chefs. And we're moments away from trying our fans. I know. Our fans awesome. are, I let's can't go, wait for let's that. go, oh, let's go, let's go. Exciting, yeah. We're, back to you guys in the studio. I'm jealous you're in good company. We had G Garvin on the show a few weeks ago on Weekend Express. Hey, G, you were awesome. It was great to have you. Uh, you guys have fun. We'll check in with you in just a little bit. Brian McFadden got the Cush gig today. He's right in the middle of a tailgate cookout. He is uh, with celebrity is chefs and judges, and they're ready to sink their teeth into some goodness. Hey, guys. <laughs> yeah, we are. This is, this is absolutely incredible. Our college football fans made us some deliciousness. Judges, what do you think so far? Texture? It looks amazing. Gene Garvin's not wasting great. any time. Okay. When we come back, we're going like to... We're gonna, breakfast I'm going in. Right here. Absolutely. Beef, pork, it, and more pork. Be tons of eating happening over here. Everything wrapped in bacon. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't go anywhere. Everything Tons better with goodness, bacon. You guys, I'm coming down after the show. Tailgating begin. It is college football season. It officially kicks off this weekend. That means grills from coast to coast will be dishing out the goods. So to test it out for you, beforehand, Brian McFadden uh, warmed up his belly for a very own cook-off. So what have you got there? <laughs> Well, I, well, right now it's uh, we're hotter than three celebrity chefs in a kitchen. It's so hot out here. Oh my God! So, yeah, let, let's get right to it. This is the yeah. Tums Ultimate Tailgate Cookoff. The, the, our fans made us some good good eats right here. Let's start with Brian Fortune and Mike Mahaffey. They made these barbecue pork sliders. Gentlemen, go ahead and dig yourselves right into there. I'm gonna taste them in a we second. Take a couple of Tums first, oh, bro. Oh, yeah, you probably should take some Tums first. The, these two guys are they're pretty good friends. They're neighbors actually. Brian uh, is in printing, and then uh, Mike is an orthodontist. So if your kids need some braces, that's where you go. Right there. All right, let's go. Let's move on to the next one. Let's let's get right to it. Uh, yeah, barbecue brisket bacon blue cheese sandwich. Oh man. <laughs> that I want to put my. Come Lynn, are you looking at this? Of course this I am. I'm that drooling. I really, I'm I've been waiting to, waiting to eat this, think. but I can't right. eat it until I'm done talking. <laughs> Fellas, what do you mm. think of this one? Mm. Wow. Wow. This reminds me of uh, when I'm on your show, Lynn, when we do. Uh, well, bacon. You're the weekend okay, bites. Now let's get. Now let's get to Peggy's. Oh, the weekend bites is my favorite. Okay, let's get right to this. All right, so this is Peggy Grimes. Mother always said, "Chew your food." Yes, chew your food. Jalapeno cream cheese stuffed sausage wrapped in bacon. Now she told me, Peggy, she's like, Brian, I must warn you, there's a kick. And Ooh. Peggy, she's a she's a diehard uh, bulldog fan. Go dogs! Go dogs! Go dogs! Go dogs. Go dogs. Go dogs. 
What do you guys think, oh, fellas? Shane, that's crazy, man. That's I like the way you. It's got the big green egg smell. I got the green egg smell. Now, what is the green egg? Big green egg, ceramic Kamado cooker. It's, it's <clears throat> invented in Atlanta. You guys talk about it like it's. It's just been. It's, oh, it's. It's the holy water for food. food. It's, it's unbelievable. unbelievable. Really oh, so good. you guys have had, had a taste of all three, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah. when we come back, we're going to reveal who wins the Tums Ultimate Tailgate Cook-Off Challenge. Another level, baby. Another <laughs> level. Let's go. All right, the moment of truth is here. Brian, ready to crown the winner of our Tailgate Cook-Off. Guys, Woo! you got some tough decisions to make. Oh, man. Man, Lynn, I, my eyebrows are sweating, and it's not from the sun, it's from the food. Holy cow. Oh, oh, nice. That jalapeno cream yeah. cheese stuffed sausage, that was something else. Hey, all right, guys, the, the moment of truth, we had three. We had uh, Brian and Mike's uh, pork, barbecue pork sliders. We had Mark's uh, barbecue brisket, which is really yeah. tasty. And we had Peggy's jalapeno cream cheese stuffed sausage. Awesome. The moment of truth. Kevin? All, listen, all of them are fantastic. Okay, right. all, of them, all of them very good. Great job. But when yeah. it comes to tailgating, ease. You know, I, I'm oh. kind of, you know, I'm a closet eater, so, like, I like to get things I can take two or three and go hide behind a car. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. So, you know, you want to You know, it's funny because that? everything has incredible flavor. The attention to detail is yep. all there. Yep. Um, unfortunately, the yeah. brisket was really hard to eat. Yep. I mean, but it's, it's it's hard to not love it because the flavor's there. Absolutely. And then the slider, what do you think about the slider, Chef? I thought the slider was good. Um, you know, it's it's, it's it's a staple. It's it's it's, it's wonderful. It was, it was soft. Um, mm. It pulled great. The bun was... The, the bun was soft. Yeah. That's a huge thing. You don't huge want the, you know, you don't want tough bun. All right, quickly, fellas. All right. So here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna say. Wait, yeah. We gotta go with this right here, baby. Oh, oh the jalapeno cream cheese stuff sausage. That's Peggy. Peggy, it's, it's good. Makes you want to drink more beer too. How do you yeah. feel? To the roof. This is super exciting. You know, like you said, the presentation that brisket is just awesome. The classic slider, and I was feeling a little intimidated with my little bacon wrapped sausage there, and. That's good sportsmanship right there. What, very nice. So very it nice. is. And so it was a close everything run. Everything's better close with run. bacon, baby. That's it, no doubt about it. So on behalf of uh, HLN and the Morning Morning Express <laughs> Show, we'd like to present this to you. Peggy <laughs> Grimes, bragging rights for the 2014 college football season. Holy cow. I'm going to bring some of this. I'm bring it all back good job, to the good studio. Good job, good job. For you, Bob you better. I'm sending down some Ziplocs as we speak. See you soon, guys.